Hey guys, in this video I'm gonna show you how and why you should cuff your pants. And that's not just for jeans, but for any pants you wear. Let me explain why you should do it. Number one, if you cuff your pants, you can perfectly adjust the pants to fit in with the length of your legs. Number two, it is stylish. The pants won't hang sloppy over your ankles, but it will look tapered. And it will look especially good if you are a fan of fashion socks and want to show them off. Number three, you can cuff them in a way that would make your pants fit in with your ankle size. For example, I have skinny ankles and that is why my pants always look baggy down there and cuffing them correctly is an easy fix. All right, so let me show you how to cuff your pants according to your body shape. Let's get to it. Now just very quick, it's the first time that you hear my channel. My name is Daniel and welcome to DLM Men's Lifestyle. If you haven't subscribed yet, please consider it so you won't miss any of our future videos and the ones we already have. Now, let's start with number one. All right guys, now the fastest and easiest way to cuff your pants is the simple roll. All you do is fold it up one to four times depending on your height. For example, if you're a short guy, you might roll it up a few times more than taller guys. It's super easy and it's perfect for big guys with bigger ankles. But for guys with a bit more skinnier, skinnier ankles like me, it always falls down. If that happens to you, you can do number two. Just use a rubber band. So do the simple roll, but get the band in there to hold it in place. Easy, isn't it? Now some guys prefer to smooth out the cuff a little bit more to make it more flat, even, kind of perfect. Um, I don't really like that. Um, it's, it's your choice. I like it more uneven, rough, rugged, because I don't want to look that perfect. But the choice is yours. Now the pin roll. This is honestly the best way to cuff your pants according to your ankle size. All you need to do is fold it over the inseam of the leg vertically, hold it with your thumb and fold it up normally two to four times. It will look nicely tapered and it will stay in place. Now the width of the roll, that of course depends on you. It depends on what you like, what you prefer. And that of course goes for the simple roll as well. You can try the single cuff, which is of course a single cuff of about four to five centimeters. The iron worker, or some call it the mega cuff, which is just one big cuff about eight to 12 centimeters. This is better with rugged boots. Then there's the skinny roll, which is just a very thin cuff rolled up two to four times. This works really well with pants that are tight. Another one is the Japanese cuff. This works great with denim and all you do is roll one big cuff of around nine centimeters and then a smaller single cuff on top of that so that the first one sticks out a bit. Oh, and this is one of my favorites. If it's summer, you feel hot. This is what you do and you just go and you let loose. The summer cuff. You gotta roll up your pants in an uneven manner, two to four times and it can be above your ankles if you want. This is just a manly casual look that basically says, I wanna have fun. That's why I like it so much. Now, if you're new here to the channel, watch one of these videos here, you might like it. And always remember this, life is short, so don't waste yours. Cheers guys.